Five o'clock, get this, Greenwood is turning hundreds of thousands of plants into multiple pieces of art that you can enjoy. That's pretty cool, Fox Carolina's Michaela Leggett takes us inside this amazing operation. If it wasn't for the weeds, we wouldn't have half the work to do. <laughs> From the Clemson mascot. So we plant lots of plants around him. To animals you might not see in the wild. That's our punk rock pee. <laughs> She's got her curly mohawk on. Jimmy's still got to put her some eyelashes on. Greenwood horticulturist Jimmy McInville and Diana Fetter taking topiaries to the next level. And so we had an elephant. We had a jeep because it was a safari, so you needed a way to get around the safari. There were monkeys and giraffes, but the safari theme has kind of expanded because now we have a mermaid. So Spending nearly a year getting them ready for the South Carolina Flower Festival in Greenwood. I say I start in August when they come in and I work on it every day. I go or make rounds around the house every week. So I'd say there's months of hours. <laughs> All the plants that we put on her are uh, pretty self-sufficient. They don't take much from us. With the proper care and maintenance and enough water, these topiaries can last up to five months. This small team taking great care of more than 20 beautiful arrangements. This is a Juga, Repans, Repans, Reptans, Reptans, also known as Bugleweed, and it's a vicious weed in your yard. But here we cultivate the prettier varieties than what grows in your yard and use it on the topiaries because that are always finding a new plant. This fern right here. That is a volunteer. It just came up on its own. We didn't plant this. Uh, we have to pull it out kind of regular because it spreads. McInville finding joy in seeing people stopping to smell the flowers. Oh, it's fantastic. And to see the people. The greatest thing in the world is to watch the kids, even adults, when they see these things on the street. They get so excited. We have people that come back every year to see them. Reporting in Greenwood, Michaela Leggett, Fox Carolina News.